Intervertebral discs are flexible elastic pads located between the individual vertebrae. They allow bending and rotation of the spine. Each disc consists of an inner nucleus called the nucleus pulposus, surrounded by a fibrous ring structure called the annulus for fibrosis. During a disc injury, the inner layer can protrude outwards and irritate spinal nerve roots. During the procedure, a patient lies on their front. Prior to the actual procedure, we apply local anaesthetic to desensitize the skin. An X-ray device is also used during the procedure to enable a precise intervention under control of X-rays. After tissue desensitization, we carefully insert a guiding needle to the edge of the disc. And confident about the precise location of the guiding needle, we insert an even thinner needle through to the disc's inner layer. With the needle inside the disc, a contrast agent is injected. The patient may feel pressure or pain during administration of the contrast agent. If in pain, the patient is questioned about whether the pain is similar to their usual pain. If it's similar, there'll be a likelihood of disc damage.